Hello, good day everyone. I'm Tebs. Welcome back to this channel. Today's repair is an Acer Aspire V5-471. Not turning on and not charging. I will show you how it will going to repair. If you like this content, so please don't forget to like share and subscribe. You can also ring the notification bell so you will be notified every time I upload a new video. So let's get started. Undo all the screws. I will remove the keyboard and unscrew the other screws under it. Disconnecting the power switch plat wires connector and also the touchpad plat wire connector so it will freely separate this top cover. Dust and debris may cause this laptop to power failure. A laptop with no power common problem is a short DC line. So I will measure the main 19 DC line. The digital multimeter is set to continuity. Beep means possible shorted component. It's most likely a MOSFET or a ceramic capacitor. I measure a shorted. I will remove the motherboard and see the other side. This resistor is the current load detector, it connects to the main DC 19 volts, it is shorted. Now I will inject 3 volts of about 6 amperes into the 19 volts DC line. I'm going to use my old AC to DC converter transformer type. It sets to 3 volts unregulated. The shorted component will heat up and will be easy to identify.
I feel heat on this area. I will put a soldering paste to see which component is heating up. Injecting 3 volts. It shows the capacitor is heating. The shorted is gone. The ceramic capacitor is 4.7 microfarad 35 volts. Not like the factory soldered, but it's connected properly. Looks all okay now and ready to reassemble. Looks working now. A few moments later. The laptop is working great. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my video. Once again I'm Teps. See you again next time. Bye for now.